first round of heat's done and it was really the third round that was absolutely chaos. Have a look at the damage to Nick Lacey's race suit. But the good news is, ta-da, completely fine later on. What is it like being on fire? Um, the main part about it is um, don't breathe too much, obviously, because then you, you can actually burn your own lungs. So very hot, obviously, like standing next to a fire, but even more intense because you're enclosed in a helmet. Um, basically, yeah, you just don't panic and uh, get out as quick as you can. Run through exactly what happened. Um, basically, start of the race, I could just feel a cold breeze, basically, which means you get a little bit of methanol on you. Uh, once we got going, obviously, a lot of methanol came because the fuel was pumping, obviously, through the system. Um, nothing happens without with fuel without a spark, obviously, so a lot of fuel doesn't matter. Um, but when we stopped, the excess debris fuel in the exhaust, a little flame, boom, just follows. Obviously, the flame follows the fuel up, so. So you got out of the car, you looked pretty panicked at that point, and then did you start to notice this is getting worse? Yeah, definitely. I mean, I saw the flame in the car, um, but I was soaked myself. And uh, unfortunately, like methanol, it's a very, very light blue flame, um, so you can't see it. And then it, it's, it catches the light very quickly and burns very hot. So it was very warm instantly. Um, but it wasn't for these uh, beautiful Revolution race gear suits, um, I would have been burnt. So. Right, well, awesome. Nick, we're glad to see you okay, buddy. We'll let you get back to it because I know that the uh, next round of heats is coming up. So you get back to that.